sexy forest animals of the internet. Welcome back to a new episode of Let's Play Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. I'm your host, Akalis, and when last we left our adventure, we had just taken down Sundowner. Went down on my sword. Look at all the British petroleum points we got, or <laughs> as one of my viewers, Mysterious JG, calls them, <laughs> riding bucks. Custom cyborg body, desperado. Who, why don't you come to your senses? Ooh, oh, we have sundowners, uh, broadswords. Ah, oh. it's too bad we don't get his explosive shield. I can do well enough without it. Could use a few more arms. That that would be nice. Yes, actually, I would love to customize Raiden's body. Um, let's see. We've got regular body. Holy shit. That, that's actually pretty badass. I mean, how many different nuances? Do it, do I go with my, my staple Wolfen Slate Gray or... Evil Raiden, Rah! It's a little more befitting of his Ripper mode. I don't want to emulate some other... let's see... Are there any... real differences? Between? Cyborg frame pattern and style of Desperado Enforcement Contractors. The performance of this frame are identical to those of the normal custom cyborg body, so I'm going to stick with gray for now. Our main weapon... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and up to strength if we're able. Absorption rate. May as well. Let's just max this puppy out. Strength 4. At least that much, at least. At least. At the very least. And what I wanna do... Do we have any new techniques for our other weapons? Pinscher blades. I got a Buy them? Sure, let's try them out. Oh, four... Five thousand away. Four thousand two hundred and forty-two points. We'll, uh, we'll work on that one. Can I up your strength at least? Ah, oh, so close. How about you? Can I at least put you on equal footing? I can. Sure. I'll do that. And it costs another 12,000. So, can we up our 40 grand? I'm guessing we really don't have enough money to buy. Oh! That's riding the pole. <laughs> riding the pole. Riding on the pole. And a new technique with pincer blades is only 2,000 away. Let's see. Tur turbulence. An updated version of Raiden Cyborg Body firmware that re retunes his use of the bloodlust shears based on battle data taken from Sundowner. With this, he can follow up with a slash. Follow up a slash with a powerful downward strike. Stormbringer. That's pretty crazy looking. And I did want to save up for quick draw because that is a that is another attack he has uh, in um, PlayStation All Stars. It's the one I was talking about earlier where he he just kind of appears. Nope. No back. No back. And he just kind of appears several uh, steps away from himself, and ah, uh, there it is, energy enhancement. If this is, in fact, the final mission I'm coming up on, um, probably don't have much longer to go. 
I've made the decision to chop these videos up into finer pieces so that they don't take nearly as long to process and, uh, you know, you're not sitting anywhere for two and a half hours. But I, surely, I surely hope you're getting a, at least a little bit of a kick out of these videos. I'm having fun making them, to be quite honest with you. I do love high action, high reaction games. Now let's see what all this Mach 23 business is about. I have the fans off to cut down on the ambiance. Ah, El Doctor! Excellent. Commencing takeoff in semi auto mode. So I'm hoping it doesn't reach a gajillion degrees in my room. Can't recall if I had it on last time or not. You know, this kind of space launch once required days of preparation. Solus has been conducting test flights almost every day for the last six months. As long as we're not breaking atmosphere, they said they can reroute today's flight no problem. Maybe I should have done Amazing. some VR missions. The Earth is the cradle of humanity, but mankind cannot stay in the cradle forever. <laughs> I'm only going as far as the thermosphere. This thing can't pass the Carmen line. That lunar vacation will just have to wait. And here I was riding you might bring me back a monolith. In space. Scheiße! Two bogies closing fast! Is it? Who else? The flight pattern suggests unmanned MQ-320s. Aerial mission! Shit. This is a transport chopper. Our defensive options are limited. Y you got me. You really don't have any other choice. Missiles incoming! Let's see if I remember how to do anything. Half away! strong enough to take out the drone. Looks like I'm gonna have to do some bomber hopping. Here they come. Here they come. Here comes the are headed from out nice in the sky. And people say Germans aren't funny. Now, how is this gonna work exactly? Y'all supposed to make me think ain't no ground. There's a ground. Granted, it's a little far. Down below. Oh, I'm gonna jet jacket. There it is. Swerve. You're mine. All right, bring the chopper around. Hacking the. Close shave. We're gonna bisect it. That can be the only course, yeah. It is now twins. Predictable, but still pretty stylish. And, um, you know what? That's not good. Just don't approach me from below. I said don't approach me, goddamn. Um. Are you, are you gonna do a barrel roll? Whoa! That's a close shave. Get your shave as close as possible with El Doctor Shave! Ah, oh, this helicopter is made of shit! Oh, goddamn mental sprawns helicopter. Shit. Wow! Doctor, don't, don't go down there. I'll, I'll be fine. Just take your ass out of this airspace. Sorry, my friend. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. 
I understand, Doc. I will be just fine. You get your ass out of here and back to safety. Ball, Raiden. I'm glad to Can't see move. that you are alright. It's time you got out of Denver. Whoa, what? Hi. No. Wow, right into the thick of things. How? There we go. You know what? I think it's time we tried out our. Oh, okay, that's not what that button does. Ugh. Of course, we can't uh, uh, change our weapons until we're standing stock still. Pincer blades, bloodlust, a pair of giant high tech frequency machetes that can be combined to form massive shears. Difficult to follow in motion, they are particularly effective at catching their prey off guard. Developed after careful analysis of Sundowner's battle data. Difficult, are they? I'll get a hang. Handle on them. You know, after I come back to life. Don't you worry none, baby. Come on. I want to give these the fall, new honeys a test drive. Right. It's time you got out of Denver. Now that I know, remember how to lock on. Oh. Hut, 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 hut. Let's be a little more on target then. Ah, yeah, yes. Oh, new techniques we uh, learned while fighting Sundowner. Can we get your left arm data? We can. I'm gonna be more mindful about that too. Harry. Damn, I thought I was on target with that. Oop, oop, oop. Am I even? No, not really. All right, it's long overdue. Holy shit! Those things are huge. I had no idea. Oop, 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 oop. Give me those. Useful. Sure, I'll take that too. Good God. B grade. Oh, I can charge them. I can handle you just and what will you do? No. Get out of here and to the launch site. Ah, Oops. the young ladies' company, yeah? How fortunate they are in Colorado. I might have to, uh... Yeah. Shouldn't take more than two hours with a set of wheels. Guess I'll just have to borrow some. Redo that a battle. Cars got abandoned when the so I can get that dialogue. Out. But won't the roads be blocked? If you are struck by one of those missiles, or... I know. Let me just worry about putting some distance between me and World Marshal. What's left of it. Well... <laughs> It's not as if the dialogue between El Doctor and I would be fairly revolutionary or novel. Uh, he got the hell out of there. He was asking Raiden if he was going to be okay, and Raiden was basically like, yeah, yeah, I'll survive. Um, that skipped because I was trying out Sundowner's charge technique. Evidently, I can charge my pincer blades to do something nasty like this. Cut the whole damn world in half. What? What? Oh, hi. Wow. Takes a while to charge up! No. I'm wise to your game. Oh, let's see what kind of aerial techniques. First of all... Oh. Take care of that damn gun. There we go. Didn't take too kindly to that, did you? No. Wow. Do you guys mind? I'm conducting 
Delicate medical operations on... Ah! It's distracting me. And for that, you lose a missile launcher. Come on, buddy. Answer me. Shit. Gang bang by Metal Gears. That's a first even for me. All right. Get the fuck out of Denver. Well, oh, I just violated my own credo of not destroying nature. Oh, hey, I can, uh, I can actually take advantage of the fact that they haven't seen me yet. Shit! And utterly fuck that up. They're not as bad as the Crocs, though. That doesn't belong there. Punish. Does a lot of damage. Better for as slow as it fucking is. Haven't you learned your lesson from the last motherfucker who tried this on me? You lose! Your gun turret. If I can find it. Thought I parried that. Give me those! They're gonna be better use in my hands than yours, friend. That uh, cowardly fucker. No. Whoa! Spinning blades! Uh, energy! I think? What do you got for me? Weakness! Cartwheeling ninja moves. This is for me. Where's the last one? Well, so much for stealth. Um, just to demonstrate that last maneuver I did, in case you didn't get a good indication of useful treasure over here. Just a second. Is that a life upgrade? Endurance plus one. I don't think it's an official one, but uh, still useful all the same. Anyway, here we go. Aerial sundown maneuver, and this is holding the button down. Where the hell does that thing go? It's bigger than you are! That's a single button push. You have multiple strikes? Nah. Oh, but I, uh, I think that's enough. Or, or basically, when I buy, is that a checkpoint? When I buy my second sundowner technique, or it will add another swing. Um, do I have any special techniques for it? Well, first of all, uh, if you didn't get a good indication the last time. Back forward and sword is a shockwave maneuver. Forward twice is his launcher maneuver. Let's see. Oh, that's back forward and kick. And that's uh, forward forward and kick. Does he have a sword hold? Ma no, not yet. I think that's quick draw. Anyway. I wanna... I really hope this starts me after... Doesn't need to get stronger. It needs to... 
get more versatile. Storm Blingel. That's uh how. I'll be back. Now, as I as I explained to Mysterious JG, my usual technique as far as games go, when the option is available, ah, it's no big deal. No big deal. I can stealth kill Metal Gear, no problem. Where was I? When I usually play games of this nature, I favor skills over life enhancements. I mean, I try to get them in tandem with each other. Is there a Metal Gear over there? But, um... When I have the option of making a weapon more versatile, I like to take it when I can. But I don't know... Shit! Oh well. No, you don't. No, you don't! What did I tell you? Bad Metal Gear! Bad. Bad, bad, bad. And now, I get your organs. I hope you've learned your lesson. Where'd you go? Maybe something explosive might be a little more useful than a box. What do you got for me? Impressive kick. Uh, we got these skills. Better make the most of them. Ugh. I will show you that they actually are worth having. Ah, oh, you pussy. Come here. It's time for the guts. Ah, bunch. One more. You know where you're going, buddy? Into this here wall. Did I soften any parts up for you? I'm sorry. That just does not fly for me. I need an upgrade just to carry this thing for more than... Ugh, five seconds. Some dots. That's right. No sweat. So we got a second swipe with Sundowner's weapon. Wow. <coughs> Those things are heavy as shit. Yep. Any other goodness here? Up here, maybe? Green blips? I don't think we're gonna have those in this mission. So! Before we get to that, this whole, uh, mock faster than normal mission, we have to escape the city. Before we escape the city, we're gonna need more boxes. Amazing, I actually haven't reached my quota of boxes yet. Just make sure this ATV gets chopped into tiny pieces. Can't go back there. Hello, hello. Can I get up there? Whoa, stop running. For just a moment, we can get red phosphorus. <laughs> Swords as big as these still don't cut a cop car. Whoa. Hatchback. Wait a minute. 
I'm sorry, that just does not compute. That's better. The water in that thing. And this is where we last encountered the hologram. Oh, Sam. That's a up. Oh. A heavy guy. I don't care. I'll take heavy guy. Damn, he's got a wide swing. Well, guess what? I've got something similar to that. Damn it! He's swift! He's so crafty! Sit! Did I get that last left on? Oh! Pesky! Guts! Now what's shooting at me? Where's the dead man who wants a depleted uranium broadsword in their pee hole? Well, that covers a lot of ground. I need this, guys. Fuck yeah! You guys are going up in the earth. So am I. I carved them into little itty bitty bits. Shilanko. Right, hurry. It may be an RLB, but it still needs time to accelerate and decelerate from first cosmic velocity. It could require more than 30 minutes to get to Pakistan. What's that? Oh. You want some of this tripod? I will broadsword all of you. No. Yeah. Yeah. Shockwave. Breakdance move. Can I rapid tap that? I wonder. Nah, just one. Because it's a it's a sweep maneuver. It's meant to take enemies off their feet. Don't want to alarm the tripod. Hmm. Swift enemies. Yeah. I don't give a shit if you see me or not. You guys are weak and annoying, but I. I missed one. Problem solved. You can stop with the groovy music now. The threat is dispatched. I'll take another one of these. That's always nice. Uh boy. That's not prophetic at all. Alright, show me the hind. Show me the hiney. There's no way I'm There we go. Yep, stunned ya. The last video I didn't even re uh I think I did. I think I realized that the thing stunned enemies. Where are you? I can't stealth around easily with those guys just swooping over head constantly. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get to what looks like a mini boss and then I'm gonna I'm gonna cut it just to be sensible. Uh this ought to do. Hush, Dante, with your groovy battle music. Oh, oh you brought friends. Yeah. You know what you guys get? 
since you're big and stupid. That was a good try. God damn it! Oh shit, your EMP. Do you need those? I'm sorry. I'd like to see how you get around with Adam. No. Get the fuck off me! Nope! Enough of that. Wow, this thing has a wide slice radius. Oh, they're both still alive! How comical! You know what? I'm gonna get two for the price of one. Now hold very still. I don't want to accidentally cut you. Maybe I do. I didn't see you. What's tromping around? How many pieces do I have to cut this damn thing into? Ugh. You fucking tripods are annoying as shit. Ugh. <laughs> I cannot believe. That's what that booming is. Stop all that nonsense. It's just sad. No, oh, come here. Ugh. I told you I don't want any. Now, let's do this right. A guts. Do you have them? Where? couple more of these, and that'll mark an episode. Oh, we are being so ninja, it hurts! Wah! Wait, we have 1,600. And if I'm not mistaken, that was a checkpoint. I'm doing this now because I keep forgetting about my riding bus. <laughs> New skill. A third swing. <laughs> ah, two thousand more. Falling lightning. <gasps> I don't need a third swing. There's a devastating spinning strike. Forty thou, yeah. We're nowhere near enough to go. Twenty thou. Actually, I really should upgrade my fuel. I run out of that more than anything. Life comes along fairly frequently. But in a pinch, I need to be able to... Are you kidding me? may cut this video sooner than I thought. Alright, who wants it first? You, evidently. Look! Down, Raiden! Oh well, we achieved the desired effect. You, come here. This makes killing you guys a lot easier. No guts for me because you're unmanned aircraft. Um. Okay, I, I suppose we have to be stealthy around these guys. 
I don't see how that is going to happen because they have wicked peripheral vision. So just die, why don't you? Ugh. Okay, we learned our lesson about upgrading things. Nice try. Come here. Where are those pesky things? Is somebody else doing things? That's how these things are supposed to die. Right, counter. Yeah. Did we stun you, kitty? Uh, I hear legs are useful for robotic kangaroos. They're trying to kill me. We. We want innards. Extinction level event. It seems as though I have the strangest craving for innards. Okay, if I alert more of you guys, are you going to bring more ruse to the party? Oh no! More tripod reinforcements! Eh. You're just gonna blow yourselves up. No patience for fucking tripods. I just hate the fact that they call other people around. What's that? It's things for me. Alright! Now. I've located the route with relatively light security. I will mark the heading on your soliton radar. It's just one guy so far. He looks like a gimme. What's the big blip? What is the... B it's a tank. So we better ready our heat-seeking missiles. <laughs> And our big blades. I guess we can move a little faster than that. No. I'm afraid that is what's gonna happen. Oh, they're talking about a uh, shit. Thanks for the memories! Can't you guys see I'm busy? Oh, I'm out of rockets. Alright, off the tank for a moment. I need a snack! Thank you! Ah, uh, time to dodge bullets now. Where's your left arm? I think I got it already. There you are. We want horizontal cuts to take care of these vertical objects. Yeah! What else do you got for me? Weak! Yeah, 
damn it. I don't think I'm gonna hit you with this bigger blade. <laughs> That's it. At least not easily. Your bullets and missiles are slow. Fancy moves for a tank. Not fancy enough. Damn it. I guess if I'd done a little better job of stealthing around, I might have been able to save this dude. I don't know what kind of rewards you get when you do. Okay, I made myself a doggy door! <coughs> Hasn't been too terribly long, has it? Uh, 45 minutes? That's about 15. Did some audio cuts before this. Um, I'm gonna wait for some more dialogue from I will join you in Pakistan. Wolf. I will find a way to exit the helicopter. Proceed out of the city. I will contact you when I am on the ground. And with that, I think we're going to take a little break for this episode of uh, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Uh, tested out our... showcased our new weapon from Sundowner. It's pretty... pretty badass, if I can just get a, a handle on the big girl. Anyway, thanks for joining me yet again on another adventure of Let's Play Metal Gear Rising Revengeance with your host, Akalis, the Wolf Wars. I hope to see you later, lovely beasts. Ciao, rough.